A fast, spinning object on screen may sometimes appear stationary or to rotate slowly in either direction. The effect isn't confined into just spinning objects. Any repeating movement synced with shutter speed will create this illusion. Video cameras capture still images of a scene at finite rate and the brain fills in these gaps between these images by creating the illusion of continuous motion between similar frames. If the wheel rotates most of the way around between one frame and the next, the most obvious direction of motion for the brain to pick up on is backwards since this direction suggests the minimal difference between the two frames. Similar effect can be observed with spinning object and stroboscope. On a specific rotation speed and stroboscopic frequency, hypnotic animations can be created. Novotrope is an apparatus that utilizes this interaction to create an illusion of impossible infinite motion. Novotropes have perfected their product to be an elegant blend of technology and biomimicry that creates a mesmerizing optical illusion. The wagon wheel phenomenon isn't just limited on screen or in uh, stroboscopic conditions people experience the effect in real life, even in continuous light. Two competing theories explaining this are rolling around the academic journals for acceptance. One proposes that the visual cortex, much like a movie camera, processes perpetual input in temporal packets taking a series of snapshots and then creating continuous scene. Perhaps our brain processes these still images as it does frames in a movie, and our perceptual mistake results from a limited frame rate. While some form of temporal aliasing certainly occurs in the brain, it isn't clear that this is sufficient to explain the wagon wheel effect in continuous light. One key experiment shows that when observers watched a rotating drum and its mirror image, almost all illusory motion reversals occurred for only one image at a time. The result indicates that the motion reversal illusion cannot be explained by snapshots of the visual field according to the movie camera theory. The two wheels should not behave differently since the frame rate is the same for everything in the visual field. This has led scientists to theorize the effect to be a result of perpetual rivalry that occurs when the brain creates two different interpretations of an ambiguous scene.